So in the market at this point in time, there are a couple of different ways that a mortgage interest rate can be calculated. You currently have fixed options and variable rate options. For fixed options, these tend to come in either two, three or five years for a time period. And very simply, with a fixed rate, you secure the interest rate for that period and then your interest will effectively be charged against that until that rate term ends. So whether that be after the two, the three or the five years. With variable rate options at present, there are either tracker mortgages or standard variable rate mortgages, of which there is also a discount available with some lenders. A Bank of England base rate tracker mortgage is very simply based against the Bank of England base rate. And a variable rate is based against an uh, in-house rate that every lender holds and will vary depending on where that bank wants to position it at that point in time in the market. Um, as I mentioned, the discount can often be applied against that variable rate depending on how the bank decides to, to discount the rate at any certain point in time. In addition, there are other flexible options as well, such as offsetting and overpayment facilities, but that's very much dependent on the lender and not every bank in the market currently offers those options. The advantage of taking a fixed over variable very much relies upon the point that with a fixed rate you know exactly what you're going to be paying for a period of time without any changes and obviously that makes it much easier to budget than it would do if your rate was fluctuating depending on changes to the market. And then the advantages to a variable rate are very much so that in a market where the interest rates can fluctuate and ultimately could reduce, you may be able to secure a rate now that could over time reduced to the point where you're saving yourself quite a lot of money. An offset mortgage is a, a great choice for someone that's in a position where they know they're receiving variable, variable amounts of large lump sums of money um, at different points throughout the year and they're in a position where they can save that money and want to pay off lump sums of their mortgage or ultimately have the option to reduce the mortgage over time and actually have the flexibility to access that money at any point in time. So it isn't for everyone, but as an option, it's, it's probably the most flexible in the market at this point in time.